Hello, everybody. I'm Prosper Goddess. Um, do not force any reading to fit. Know your story, know your life, and always take it back to the Most High God in prayer and in meditation, okay? Um, what did you do, okay, to make a witch or a warlock, okay? Yeah, witch or a warlock with the moon being here, okay? A, a, a high-class illusionist is what I just heard, okay? Um, whatever they were trying to build off your energy, off your essence, off your aura is now being taken, okay, from a covenant, from a collective of individuals that, um, for some of you that you don't know, people that wanted to dibble and dabble because of the level of evolution and upgrade your life has been opposite from theirs is what I'm seeing as well. Thank you, Holy Spirit, because it feels like you, uh, an, an escape. Okay, principalities just knew um, you'll continue to let in that. A principality just knew that you'll continue to let individuals that didn't know your value um, siphon your energy or to build up their lives is what I'm seeing here. Okay, this was bigger than people, places, and things. These were principalities that had the ability to attach themselves to, you know, family, friends, lovers. Like it was like the made like the media, the major underworld. Okay, major. Um, spiritual um, reckon, okay? A risk the devil hope that you that you would have never made or you would never take. This is what led a whole empire of witchcraft and strongholds get dis get dismantled in your life collective. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It's like you grew spiritually, but still around other people who weren't or accepted of what you know or didn't know as much as you which caused a lot of envy and jealousy that you know you shouldn't be around and this is why um some of my collective didn't understand why so much setbacks blockages or inconveniences but that's over with now you literally left rather this is change numbers because i just heard change thank you holy spirit change addresses change jobs um change your view on people change your mindset major disruption due to this change collective well done okay and it has a witch and a warlock having to you know finally put in the work finally do the healing to get what their birthright is to get out of that spiritual prison to get out of that spiritual jail here okay is what i'm seeing here okay thank you holy spirit clear direct and correct messages from my collective okay what's going on here with this channel message let's see we're going to clarify and dig deeper with the tarot let's see all right holy spirit let's see what's going on here please give me the messages thank you holy spirit let's see all right we have the five of um, the five we have the five of swords and the king of cups being here okay so this i'm getting like this, even though the king of cups is a man okay gender neutral woman or man but i'm looking at this as a principality because that was the that was the download the principality right the principality of um men and women coming into your life acting like that they can fulfill you um much emotionally okay or trying to outsmart or have emotional intelligence the king of cups is someone that feels a lot of emotions that has a lot of empathy a lot of sympathy but even though they came out upright i'm just getting like your love life was definitely one of the strongholds these principalities um definitely knew that it was a gateway to constantly you know trigger you into a lack of self-development a lack of self-growth and forward movement here okay they were going to win at all cost you went to battle for this okay you went to war for this situation right and you and a lot of relationships from my collective gender neutral you could have been a lot of relationships or a lot of dynamics with people that's supposed to be supporting you emotionally but they use that vulnerability or they use that emotional state of you to actually combat a war combat feeling like they had the upper hand in this situation okay someone wanted to make you feel less than because you actually are an empath or you actually feel right until you gain the the wisdom and the strength to you know really walk out and to really change right to really transition yourself to get placed in a position of, of, of power says the most high god the position that the lord has called you to be right step to be courageous stand firm in your faith stand firm in your knowledge your discernment and things that you know to decipher good from evil period right and that was the main objective for you not to your discernment to not be um matured enough um your 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 intuition 
to not develop enough is what I'm seeing here. Like someone like their principality that were that were stuck on these individuals. Um, the whole objective was to not have your emotional intelligence be developed, discernment or intuition is what I'm seeing here. Yeah. Five, five. Okay. Major changes. Okay. I'm just seeing. For others of you. The principality wanted people that you had strong emotions towards family, friends, platonic, romantic. It doesn't even matter, right? Just love, genuine, genuine care that you have for individuals. Okay, these people were these these people these people were under spiritual warfare. Is what I'm getting here. You're about to you're about to come into the truth on why. One minute somebody's this way, it's like they just change it to a whole nother individual, change it to a whole nother person. Um, just situations that normally work out for you because you're you're used to them working out for you. Okay, just drastically not working out, right? Just, just like, I'm just getting like drastic changes because these individuals went to drastic measures. Okay, and this is something that you don't know that is coming to the forefront. Somebody went to drastic measures. Okay, arguments, fights, um, betrayals, deceit bullying arguments okay um very this part these individuals are highly opinionated about your spiritual growth about your new element of of healing okay that's what i'm seeing here and this was definitely jealousy this was definitely competition right this person is saying though well, these group of people right they used your love as a form of they can get over okay use your loyalty as a for as, as a as a as a fact to start a uh faulty foundation out of god's will like no matter what i do to him no matter what i do to her they're gonna ride right it, it started to become deceitful this per you were this person's pawn to get to get into a position to backstab other people um for some of you if you are more successful or you do have more resource you're an asset right these people looked at you as assets these people looked at you as somebody that they can that they can get in the door to situations and new environments and opportunities because of th them being attached to your name your energy your spirit do you get what i'm saying and these same individuals are now are now complaining they are now everything is backfiring everything they're gonna have to actually go out into the world and deal with those battles deal with those with those conflicts deal deal with that with that you know corrupt mind okay corrupt mind corrupt actions like somebody somebody does not have control over their actions wands is actions swords is thoughts like someone doesn't have control over their mind nor their body you see what i mean now Everything that they do is drama, gossip, negativity, croils. And in their mind is to get over, is to hurt individuals, to make people feel less than, burdened, traumatized, okay? And it, you did not see this at first, collective. You didn't see this. And that's what the principalities were banking on you to not see. Like, yeah, you're a good person. Yeah, you're full of love, whatever. But why is all of this happening? Because I'm, I'm, I'm loving, because I'm generous. No. Try to use your, 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 your strength and to convince you that it was a weakness. That's what happened here. Yep. What is this King of Cups? <clears throat> Told you. Emotional intelligence. High priestess. Someone tried to use my collective's love life as a hidden agenda. A hidden agenda. You have emotional intelligence and like we just thank you, Holy Spirit, intuition and discernment. They didn't want you to use your intuition on who actually can match this King of Cups energy, man or woman, gender neutral. I do not do zodiacs. Wanted to mirror that they are just as loving and caring to sidetrack you that 
they actually cannot control their mind nor actions. And some of these people, the truth is, them hidden and secret agendas was this. And this was somebody that you cared for. This was somebody that you loved. Somebody that you felt was a good friend. That you thought was a good friend. That you thought was ride or die. No. They rolled on you and let you die. Okay, is what I'm seeing here. They was not riding or dying. They were putting you in situations to see how you will fight for them. How you will do, like someone purposely, it's like someone purposely put you in positions around people, places, and things. And meanwhile, they're acting like they're, oh, there it is. Thank you, Holy Spirit. They was acting like they were supporting you when the drama and the chaos behind the scenes was already done. And then they're standing right beside you. Like, I got your back. It's okay. Okay, when they already did this behind the scenes and now bring you into that chaos to see how you will react to it. That's how true it is. That's how true you're about to find out. This drama, this conflict, this negativity, this gossip was, was, was fueled by this emotional person, emotional manipulative, manipulative person. Why everybody want to beef with you? Why everybody side eyeing you? Why everybody, they, they loved that. So they could be in a position to say, see, wasn't I there for you through whatever? But they made mm. unnecessary challenges and battles for you behind the scenes on purpose. And, and no matter what, it's like no matter what you go through, like this person is always there. That, that's what I'm getting. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Like, like there's something about this energy and this person. And you got away from it. You used your intuition. You trust yourself. You listen to the higher wisdom and higher knowledge that you had to get out of Dodge. You had to cut this friend off. You had to cut this man off. You had to cut this woman off. You had to cut whoever this is. That were wearing this mask and putting on this show for the longest. And you took that risk. Thank you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It goes right back to the down low. Was hoping you wouldn't take this risk. Was hoping that you wouldn't listen to the Lord. You won't. You wasn't dedicated to the commitment and the promise that the Lord has given you collected. And you did not fall for the bullcrap. You did not take the bait. Okay? Some Something clicked within my collective's mind. Like, no, this isn't. This isn't right. This isn't. This, this isn't pure. This isn't trustworthy. This isn't worth my time. And meanwhile... Yeah, things changed around, okay? Things are changing around for you. And this person really feels like their future is now very uncertain because of this. Because they know and they sense. They, they sense when you're happy or they sense when you're moving forward because you're not there to be in this chaos that they have um, orchestrated. Malevolently orchestrated. Someone was orchestrating chaos and confusion and disruption within your life. And then hoping that you'll call them about what's happening. Yeah. What is this five of? <clears throat> what is this five of wands here? Yeah. Yeah. Purposely wanted you to prove your power. To prove your strength. To prove your will. Purposely. Wanted you to test your test your power, test your strength. Okay. And for others of you, it took a lot of strength to move just in time that this deceit. What's happening? Look, someone thought that you would chase after them. You see, it's in two different positions. This person's running this way, and you chose the safer route here, is what I'm seeing. And no matter how much chaos this person or these principalities that were attached to these people tried to take your strength, tried to take your confidence, your ambition, it's like you, you, you are built to fight. You are built to move forward. You are built to find peace in, in any situation, harmony in the midst of chaos, and somebody is pissed because of it. You suppose, like, what, what, what is it going to take to get rid of him? What is it going to take to get rid of her? Absolutely nothing. Nothing. What is this five of swords here? Nothing. Yeah. Five of swords. Yep. This was happening in the past. 
Some of you guys already left this situation and then others of you, you are going to now get that inkling. Okay, listen to your intuition. Listen to your divinely guided steps. Okay. This person has put you in a position, then offer help is what I'm seeing here, collective. Put you in a position to, to belittle you or to feel like you, you cannot offer up anything or put you in a position that en enough is not getting offered to you. So they can feel good about themselves. So they can literally feel good about themselves. But in all reality, this person didn't have anything to offer you. You're coming as the high priestess and a strength card to a page, right? Someone wanted to belittle you or to take your self-worth, your confidence, or your dignity to bow, okay, here. And it's not working. Your intuition is too sharp, okay? They could be trying to block, okay, some type of movement here. Or now their movements are now being blocked. And you're defending and protecting your honor. So now things are going to be swiftly moving forward for you, collective. You broke, you broke out of something. What is this page of pentacles? You broke out of something. Told you. They act like you wasn't. Look, they want to give you enough to feel obligated spiritually to this inheritance, to this blessing. And it's not working. It's not working. Someone literally doesn't like the fact that you are blessed beyond measures. They can't get over it. They're in spiritual prison anyway. What's going on? I gotta go, guys. Yeah, you discover intuitive wisdom. You're in new territory. You unlocked every, every part of potential. This is crazy. You unlocked it, the ultimate truth. Look, escape. Didn't we say that at the beginning of the download? Thank you, Holy Spirit, for backing me up. Look, role-playing. I'm telling you, it says role-playing. You escape the transformation. Role-playing. Okay, you discovered the ultimate truth, intuitive wisdom, that it was frauds. Look, receiving sacred messages. I'm just, look, I pre I'm trying to tell you. Somebody doesn't understand. They're role-playing, storytelling. I just said gossip. This person was 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 orchestrating, role playing. I'm here for you. I'm. The, but meanwhile, some of these people in a back in, a, in the back of the scene sit back and watch to see somebody that you love dearly to you. When they knew this was gonna go down, but you escaped from this, and now you're into a new world, a whole different life, a whole different life, elemental magic. Right? They were trying to utilize primitive power or nature to transform and manifest. And it's not working here. Their manifestations are not working. They're going to have to give back everything. Like I'm just saying, somebody's going to, a witch and a warlock is going broke because of this. They're going broke because of this. Yep, meditation brings answers. You, you expanded your awareness. You're listening to your soul, finding spiritual release. You release this person. You release these situations. You no longer think. And it and look, you change the probability from unlucky situations and setbacks to setbacks that are going to put you on in a position of, like I just said, power, joy, happiness, love. Okay? Someone used all ex exempt, um, exhausted all of their options to betray you. They're going to have to pay that back. Clarify, um, for before I go, Holy Spirit, page of pentacles and a ten of pentacles. Somebody with these witches and warlocks are going to have to pay that back. Mm-hmm. What, what did you do to make this witch and warlock leave? Um, um, go, go broke. You escape, transform, listen to your intuition, up in your vibration. Your faith and hope and prayers did it. Mm-hmm. Look surface and reverse look beyond appearances un uncover the truth look that's the truth they didn't want you to see it they didn't want you to see it they didn't want the story to come out they didn't want you to see it look they wanted you to look every time they put you in something they wanted you to seek help i'm telling you shadow people are no good purposely hurt it my collective purposely Put you in positions to defend yourself, to fight, to prove how powerful you really are. Like, they just so full of jealousy. But you about to share the joy, gratitude with people that love you. Okay? You did it. Love you. Bye.